Welcome to Microwave Delights! Hello, Air Pink. What do you have there? Looks delicious. Isn't that neat? How long do we cook that? You'll be full in no time. Time to prepare that wonderful food. Make sure you follow the instructions. Just the press of a button and we're cooking! While you're waiting, you can occupy your time with an important activity. Look! It's TV magic! Time to enjoy that delightful meal! A buffalo chicken mac and cheese banquet bowl! You excited about this world? This bowl? Look at how beautiful. Look, it looks exactly like the box. Look at it. Look how much like the box it looks. <laughs> Fucking exactly. <laughs> I puke things <laughs> that look like this. <laughs> like this looks like if you were to eat this and puke it back up. Mm -hmm. Let's fucking get this shit over with. Yeah, uh, it better just, fucking taste. Just some it. noodles. Just some noodles first. Oh, I got, got me some noodles. <laughs> I mean, it doesn't smell bad, but um, kind of like it just smells like shitty macaroni and cheese. Yeah, there's a little bit of fakeness in here. There's a little bit of like school lunch smell that I'm getting. Yeah, cheers. Yeah. It's like the off-brand craft dinner. Mm -hmm. Oh, it's, well, it's got terrible flavor to it. <laughs> what? <the hell> <laughs> What is that? Is that the green flex that I'm tasting? I don't know! <laughs> what green flex? What are those? Are those supposed to be like scallions or something? It tastes like there's um, steamed broccoli water in here. What? Yeah, there's something vegetable-y. Like it, it kind of starts off tasting like a, like, a, 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 like a shells and cheese and then there's like this weird flavor. And it's like, I mean, it's got a little bit of spice to it, which is it's got a little bit of spice. Race. It's got a little bit of vinegar. Yeah. Um, what is that flavor, there's, though? Yeah, there's definitely something like, like five-day-old broccoli beef happening broccoli in there. Broccoli is a tough one. Like, I think it's supposed to be like oregano or something. That's what the yeah, it might be are, some kind but... of herbs in there, but they taste like gross, stale vegetable. Mm. And broccoli in particular is extremely powerful. You put um, that in no, anything and you cook it. that sort of like bitter... Like an irony sort of thing, huh? Mm -hmm. It's distracting is what it is, especially with like the acidic, vinegary flavor that yeah, you get. Yeah, it's very much got kind of that Frank's vinegary flavor to yeah. it. Yeah. But like it's... But when you mix that with like an off vegetable flavor, it's not good. It's hard to fuck up just like plain like cheap macaroni and cheese, but somehow... Good job, Banquet! <laughs> they found a way. Today we're drinking Barefoot Refresh Wine-Based Spritzer Moscato Spritzer 6.5% in the can. Moscato, wait. Didn't the box say it's like... Oh, it says it has aromas of peach and honeysuckle. Aromas like... of peach and honeysuckle. What? They're not using peach and honeysuckle in here. <laughs> They're just making shit up that it might smell like. Oh. Uh... So the problem is, is that like the flavor you get immediately is kind of like a really fruity, uh, honey tasting sort of nice thing. It does taste like peach. But then afterwards, you get that aftertaste that's just, it tastes like science and like alchemy <laughs> and like iron. It has a strong metallic taste that tastes like there's blood in here. Oh boy, that's no good. <laughs> it just tastes like peach and then vinegar to me. It's like it'd be great if it wasn't for the carnage. Yeah. <laughs> uh, oh, it tastes like a, I, don't, I don't know what a Moscato is supposed to taste like necessarily, but like to me, it just tastes like a white wine that's been sitting out on the counter with Apparently, no cork or anything. It tastes in like it, a and muskrat. It's just gotten <laughs> vinegary. Get right. that, look at that ch chick. Oh, it's look at that chicken. <laughs> what do you see <laughs> when you look into the depths of this chicken? <laughs> what do you see? It what peers back at you? It looks like a piece of chicken that came from a real chicken. It's not extruded, which is kind of good, maybe. 
That's real chicken. I can tell by the tendon I got. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> it's weird though, because it's, it's a weird texture though. Yeah. Like it almost tastes like if you were to eat like a bouncy ball. <laughs> Like the the ones you get out of the quarter machine. Like the ones that are like clear and have like sparkles in them. <laughs> like if you were to break that apart, like just take a big bite out of it, like that weird granular mm -hmm. rubber, super rubbery, like incredibly rubbery, like really oh, bad this, cuts. Of I don't even know if this is a piece of chicken. I think this is. A piece I think of skin. there was like breading on there too, which has all but disappeared in the mixing. I don't know. Like it, it feels like the the mac and cheese and the chicken were manufactured in completely different facilities <laughs> by different companies using completely different like ethos, and then they were mixed together at the end. Right. Like they had no idea the chicken was going to mac and cheese, and the mac and cheese had no idea chicken was going to show up at some point. All right, I'm getting some chicken and some cheese. Yeah, here. you got to mix it all together. Get yourself a good bite. This is just all around terrible. Now I know what loneliness tastes like. I was really kind of looking forward to this because I'm a little hungry right now, but this just fucks, like... No! <laughs> they fucked up so many things! They <laughs> fucked up a buffalo chicken flavored thing. They fucked up mac and cheese. They just fucked up my life. <laughs> Don't forget the peach and honeysuckle. They fucked that up too. Yeah! <laughs> this is probably Banquet's fault! This is a terrible wine and terrible dinner. This is a terrible date! I guess we've got to find out how it pairs. <laughs> no, 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 no. <laughs> this is a three for me. It's a three. Do not buy this banquet bowl. It's insulting. That's why it's a three. Not because it's that gross. Even though it is gross, it's just insulting that they would charge three forty nine for this. Mm -hmm. That's that's a fair assessment. This barefoot wine. It's awful, but I'm still going to give it a four because it's not this. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Yeah. I, 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 I concur. I'm giving it the same scores. This, this is just sadness. Sadness, mm -hmm. sadness all around. Uh, banquet. Nope. You did it again. Fajitas were bad. Mac suppose... cheese is bad. I am... We're done. We're not getting any more bowls. No more banquet bowls. Down. Humble thyself, banquet. Well done. No more banquet bowls. <laughs> like, I declare. They've let us down, but they haven't let us down. Like they, they, they're pretty much shitty all the way through. So it's like, eh. I like the pot pies. The pot pies are the only saving grace. And like I said, and then like the box chicken, sometimes you can get away with it. But all the rest of their crap is just. Yeah, this is crap. This is just crap. crap. This is crap. Please like, share, subscribe. Go check out Lofi on Twitch, TV slash Lofi Molasses. Yeah. Check out our social deeds down below. Let us know your favorite microwave meal. Thanks for watching.